Uh, we came in 1994, and uh, uh, I was three months pregnant, so the whole impression was marred by my morning sickness, which was not morning sickness, it was 24-hour uh, day sickness, and uh, I just, uh, um, I hated everything. I was 23. I'm not sure if I remember the first day or uh, a photograph from that day, because I, I kept looking and looking at that photograph, and we are photographed near from a vegetable store somewhere on Kings Highway in Brooklyn, and I'm holding a pineapple. So for me, that means coming to America. Here I am in my Russian winter coat, in my Russian winter hat, in my Russian boot, holding a pineapple. When we came here, I realized that I didn't expect uh, that much. I didn't plan our, our life. and. Uh, what I was thinking of is that it's going to be wonderful, it's going to be different, it's going to be very exciting. Uh, I will have some kind of amazing job. I had no idea w which kind. And, uh, well, just my life will be full of adventure. That's what I thought. My main reason for writing was probably that I couldn't find a job. I forgot about that amazing, wonderful, exciting job that I had in mind. I just I couldn't find any job. And I tried to learn to be a computer programmer like everybody else did among my family and friends. And I failed. I started to write kind of by accident. I have t uh, two collections of short stories and a novel. I think I know myself much better since I started writing. I know what I am. When I write well, when it's uh, just coming easily, and I, I feel extremely happy. I have a feeling that when I create American characters, not Russian, but American, there is something missing. I miss something very important about them, and I tr um, I try to compare it to Mother's Milk and formula. The formula is almost exactly the same. It, uh, chemical formula is the same, but there is something else, some something um, that you can't grasp, and I think it's missing from my American characters, and I think that's why my closest friends are Russian because there is something that I miss about Americans, and maybe something that they miss about me. I teach part-time um, creative writing at New York University. Sometimes when I encounter some problem in my writing and I uh, tell about it to my students, and sometimes they say amazing things that, uh, that actually helps me uh, maybe sometimes more than I help them. Well, I hope that I do help them. Most of the things that I do is based on my personal experience, so yes. Uh, my husband is very helpful and um, encouraging, but sometimes I feel that um, I wouldn't want him to read some of the stuff that I write. Um, I'm okay with my children because they understand me better. And I had the most embarrassing um, situation with my daughter. Was she uh, came home from school, she's only 12, and she said, oh, it's boys in my class were so disgusting, they were bragging to each other that they have a blowjob. I said, well, do you know what it is? Yes, I know. How do you know? I read about it in your book. <laughs> uh, when I look um, in the mirror, the last thing that I think is a Jewish, American, Russian writer, um, the first thing that I think is probably a woman. I know that uh, I am a Jewish mother, but uh, and uh, what I really don't want to be a Jewish mother because it's uh, somebody so overbearing, somebody who is all over with children, and I don't want to be that. I want to give them freedom, and at the same time, I feel that I can't give them freedom. I just I I can't help. I try to make them to do what I want them to do. We we speak only Russian, but uh, the kids they speak English to us. We we answer in Russian. I don't know why this is important, but I just can I just feel that it's very important because I try to tell my kids all the time about our experience. We happen to fall in this particular group, but at the same time we are part of a um, l much larger group of people ever since uh, prehistoric ages. People migrating to other places, leaving behind their culture, their language, something that they used to and starting with something completely new. I want to make a movie or I want somebody to make a movie based on what I write. No, unfortunately, no. By the time it happens, I will probably be too old to, to play myself. <laughs>